Yo, what's up boys and girls, howdy ho people. Today we are going to be playing some survival chaos. And I hope to get some sweet faction. Maybe like some sweet night elves. Or I wanna probably get like... Uh, what I wanna get? I wanna get the night elves. I want to get... I kinda wanna play humans. I feel like, you know, just this vibe of like uh, human kind uh, races, factions. Night elves are not very humankind, I do agree with that, but, I know, Iborn, I, won't, I played Nightborn probably once, I'm still figuring out like how to play them and how to play against them, I have no clue, honestly, zero clue, I play against them like I play against any other race, so yeah, I wanna play Blood Elves a little bit, so Night Elves, Blood Elves, I feel like I wanna play Elves in general, yeah, I don't wanna play Orcs. The orcs themselves are fine. I feel like I don't want to play Dark Horde, I, want to, I don't want to play Fell Horde, and I don't want to play Legion. These three factions I've been playing a lot. Because I've been getting them 24-7. And let's see what we're gonna get. We got... We got... Sorok. Okay. Sorok are not too bad. I normally would go for the Uproot Barrack, but... <laughs> I probably should not. Uh, let me read every foundation of the Sorok, I'm very curious. So we have classic approved barrack, we have uh, item merchant, you know, you can get items for the heroes. Enchanted steel, it, it's an upgrade for the base, it g gives you uh, 2000 extra HP, 2 armor and spell damage reduction for the buildings. Uh, you can hide all your units giving them 25 HP, uh, spell resistance, and you get fast reflexes, which I think is uh, evasion for tier 1 units. Uh, range unit replacement, it's a tier 1 unit replacement, I'm not entirely sure. Uh, Wilderness Survivalist, Vanguard, this one is tier 1 unit replacement, not too good. Temple Knight. This looks good. I feel like it's a new one. I have no, not seen this one before. They have reworked it, I'm pretty sure. Uh, Devotion Aura for Tier 1 Melee. I wanna play uh, these guys. Temple Guards. I, I have not played them too much, but they seem epic. So the guys have Power Eyes, a Cleaving Blade, 25% damage to do 75 damage in 150 LE. They also get 10% attack speed and 6 damage. And you get an extra upgrade uh, for the Dragon Height. And the Dragon Height affects all units, giving them chance to block uh, damage. It's only 20% to block 80 damage. I don't like it too much here. Yeah. I feel like it's not great. Uh, so it's a Blood Elf. We are playing against the uh, uh, Void Elf, right? And then the Worgen. You know what? Screw it. I feel like I can compete against the Worgen. I might be able to. Who knows? Uh, the Blood of went for the Blood Priests. It's a caster replacement. It's pretty good. In my opinion. I don't remember particularly what they have. They used to have a healing wave. Uh, Blood of also contests for the middle. Worgen is also contesting for the middle. So we have three contesters. Uh, neutral buildings. We have a gold mine on our top against the Void Elf by Richard. I'm very lucky my barrack right now is farming Richard's units while these two are fighting. That is very, very lucky. Because I'm not gonna lose too many units and now my wave is appearing and I'm gonna stack it, I think. Okay, for now I feel like I won the middle. Maybe not, no. No, I'm I will be fighting too many people. Yep. I'm fighting too many people. PG. <laughs> Foundation of Richard is unknown. Foundation of the Worgen is also unknown. Uh, Blood of is... Yeah. It's a healing wave and I feel like it's... What is that? Its attack rate is increased, but I feel like they're losing HP. So we have Unholy Frenzy and healing wave. Yeah, quite interesting combination. Sorok have extra HP regeneration, but they're uh, missing armor. 
Alright, uh, foundation of the Worgen is uh, lesser werewolf. So, there is a chance for the feral werewolves and uh, hermits when uh, in the form of the melee unit to curse an enemy they're attacking. And therefore they can spawn a... Uh, Good one, good one what? So it can spawn lesser werewolves. It's like a parasite, basically. Uh, Richard is also contesting the middle, so we have four people contesting the middle. Thank you, got your PayPal payment, Zoom. What happened was okay. What happened? Did he lose a barrack or something? Is there music? <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. I was not paying attention at all. Um, yeah, I guess we both upgrade on him. When he upgraded the middle. Did anyone go for the mercenary? Uh, yes, purple did go for the mercenary. Go for middle. We have. I have the most gold from the middle. You know what? It's. It doesn't give me too too much gold, but it does give me like a little bit more than everyone. Huh, interesting. Armor upgrade for the bad elf. Yeah, nowadays. I did not upgrade to the middle, ever. Probably for the fast, past uh, like 5 games I have not done that, unless I have like fell hounds or something. And I usually go to the sides. I usually go to the sides and I normally end up having the most gold in the lobby. Uh, like this time around, just a very strong unit. Ah, I should have gone for the healing ward, yeah my bad. Uh, it's a very strong unit and the only faction that in my head could contest me was uh, the Worgen. So I don't know. Ideally before doing all these upgrades here, yeah, I really needed to upgrade the bottom barrack. Like I really did, but yeah. Richard is defending against both of us. I feel like you're gonna have like the most gold. Yeah, look at these temple guards. Their cliff damage is epic. Can, I, can we proc again, please? Ah, BG. Yeah, it was pretty good. Fun foundation, eh? Hopefully working goes for the fun foundation. You mean uh, the guy who spawns in the middle? What's his name? Prime Zero? Alpha Zero? <laughs> Something like that, yeah. I played it against it like uh, last time. It was a very unpleasant game. Very unpleasant game. I have research speed being increased. Yeah. That's pretty sweet. I feel like I did it a little bit bad. I feel like I needed like one armor upgrade. Like few at least. Then a uh, caster upgrade before the head. Yeah, but I didn't. Uh, the Blood Elf pushed through, as it seems to be the case. Because you, can, you can't see his units, so I'm pretty sure he pushed through, and then Richard right now defended. <clears throat> uh, he upgraded his barrack to tier 2. I also did it. I forgot. I actually forgot. I forgot I did it. <laughs> Okay, let's check out the total gold. We have the most with Iron B in second place. Uh, that's very nice, except for the fact I invested too much into like uh, barracks. So I might be a little bit behind on upgrades. Uh, now he summons. Yeah, he has tier 3 barrack himself. So my plan now is to probably summon a hero. The real question is like which hero? 
I don't think it should be a melee hero, so I don't over push. But it might be a ranged one. I don't know. I want to summon like a weak hero, but enough to kick out uh, his hero if he summons, basically. Yeah, so we have three, two melee upgrades, uh, caster upgrade, yeah, all the barracks are upgraded. Looking pretty strong. Looking pretty strong. Alpha Prime Wolves, yeah. Zoom is rush in tier 2. On main as threat for some factions. Oh, it's always uh, usually bad. Is rush in tier 2 on main as threat for some factions? Uh, yes. For Fell Orcs and Dark Horde. Basically, the way you do it is that you can summon Infernos. So that's why it's so good. You can summon Infernos to all lanes, take neutral buildings and push like tremendously. So imagine like you are a Blood Elf and I'm a Fell Orc. I'm really chilling, I'm not pushing you, I have zero upgrades and at some point I summon two Infernos very very early. And you have two Infernos at your base. Then upgrade my barrack to tier 2. I do some upgrades and usually you can take a barrack. So it can be very, very strong here. Yeah. I need some tower upgrades. Question is like which? I like I really like the poison. But besides from that, I feel like everything is like eh. Uh, bonus attack rate after a kill. Poison. Impale. Dragon Hide, Stone Tablet, and Snare, Rallying Cry. Pretty sure it's a Poison Rallying Cry, and nothing else to be honest. Yeah. I think the L3 rings the bell. Uh, pretty sure doesn't really have any hard time <coughs> defending against me, by the looks of it. This Temple Guards, he can note that push piece like for a very long time, as you can see. We already have low 5 hero in the middle. The blood of also count out push me. Some heavy neutral buildings 24 7. That's very nice. Uh, poison. Poison is my best upgrade. It's like, I feel like it's one, it's actually the best tower upgrade in game. To me, it's comparable to uh, also blood sacrifice and uh, proof of strength of torrents. It's very, very good. <laughs> and probably throws. Uh, Ward bearer and uh, undead's banshee. It, it is really comparable. It's very good in my opinion. Like the Visping slows attack speed. Mom only yeah, only attack speed and deals uh, spell damage. It affects super units. Just so you know. <laughs> incredibly, incredibly powerful thing. Uh, Blood of is very rounded upgrades. I don't see. see I still don't see mana shield. And I don't know how to feel about that, TBH. Why the guy has no mana shield, I have no idea. But it's a mandatory upgrade for the Blood Elves to have like extra unit each wave, a mana shield and HP regeneration on Striders. I'm really surprised no one is summoning uh, heroes on mid. I want to get at least one upgrade on Messenry. It's gonna give my buildings uh, 500 HP and one armor. And also like it's gonna activate the spikes. So 25 melee damage, 25 damage to melee attackers. Richard is really suffering, yeah, like he can't outpush me for quite some time. Quite some time. <clears throat> Can he not? Alright, I'm gonna get a uh, poison low too, please. Uh, use my Z spell so I can channel more upgrades. Actually, I feel like I should have shot uh, priests. Like, killing them themselves with the spell. So they're very easy to kill with the Z spell. Uh, and my hero is going through. I think it's time for him to summon his hero. Oh my god, yeah, it took so much damage there. Yeah, it took quite a lot of damage there. The need think it also affects the towers, the poison. So it's 
Freedom good, yeah. All my buildings have pierce damage. Therefore, I'm supposed to be aiming light armor and unarmored. So, like a strong early game, you should try to take an early barrack. That was a good late game. Like, that was a very good late game. Like, I think it's gonna be four units. But I need extra. Nah, I need less. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I need less. A tier 3 barrack by Richard. I guess he was really losing his barrack. And I forced him to do it. Iron did not summon a hero. Our economy is like very good now. Like actually good. I really like it. I wonder if his tier 3 barrack will even defend against me. I'm very surprised Richard also doesn't have illusions and caster upgrade. Either he is very poor right now. But I don't know. If I summon a hero, I feel like I'm gonna over push, to be honest. I don't want to upgrade 6 3. I have a plan. How much gold do I have? I have 16.5k, and Iron has 15.2. I feel like I know what I wanna do, yeah. The poison low to upgrade a uh, running cry for the armor is also low too, so that's not too bad. It affects heroes. It doesn't specify whether it buffs the super units or not, so I hope it does. Cry for mercy. Cry for mercy. <laughs> Yo, what's up? Is Lidrake tipped three dollars? Can you change the sub goal? Yo, what's up, easily? Thanks so much for the three bucks. Can I change the sub goal? Uh, sure. Sure, think I can. Uh, poof. what should I change it for? Hmm. How about if I just stand over here? I have no idea. Uh... <laughs> Solo hero dominions. <laughs> you guys have been requesting for it. This caster upgrade for Serpent Wards is one of the strongest in the game. It is redonkulous. Absolutely redonkulous. Uh, Richard is summoning billion heroes. I have a small assumption. By the way, his tier 3 barrack is losing to my tier 1. Funsies. Um, I don't want to go for level 3 poison, but I don't think I can. Um, oh yeah, I was, yeah, I want to say. New goals himself, solo hero, the minion winning it. <laughs> I will try my best to win, but I don't guarantee that. Full Sorrel Cow stream. Sounds actually as a good idea. I have my, like, you know, I have like periods, right? Like, Ghost Half, I guess. When I wanna play Sorrel Chaos a lot, and I don't mind playing it, and when I don't wanna play it. Right now I'm in the stage where I like Sorrel Chaos. I guess mainly it's because. <laughs> Is Yo. Drake tipped three dollars? Okay, that sub goal can be for tomorrow, I guess. Then we Yo. playing castle defense today, okay? D. Yo, Israel, thanks so much for the fifty gift of subs. Holy fuck! Yo, thanks so much. Jesus. Holy shit, man! Thanks so fucking much. Huge! Yeah, we can. Today I'm calling me with zero flotsy, but I think he doesn't mind. We can we can play the map. He 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 has no voice on that. He he totally doesn't mind. Thanks so much! Yo, I really appreciate it. I'm leaving again, guys. Oh we are leaving to the seas again. Research complete. Eh. BG man. For how long are you gonna be again for? We will be like there also tomorrow by any chance. 
<clears throat> Is it time for 24 hour stream October again? Did I stream for 24 hours in October? I guess I could, yeah. Thanks so fucking much. Holy fuck, man. Five months, most likely. <laughs> Your trips, like, are very long indeed. Like, very so. I am not afraid. Why should I? Thank you so fucking much. But it will be tomorrow. After tomorrow, also maybe. Okay, got it, got it, got it, got it. Just trying to count how many days we have. With you more. Thank you so fucking much. Friday is question marked. Okay. Yeah, he works at the sea. My super Ninja is kind of stuck in the middle. Dude, thank you so fucking much. <laughs> you are you're the reason my sub count is like not that entirely right now. Thank you so fucking much. I don't even know, like, yeah. Uh, sub goal. New sub goal. So we're gonna play Castle Defense Fury today, tomorrow, okay? Um, good for bad, okay. Let's have smite. He doesn't have smite, so we should pressure him quite a lot. I'm of the guys who make the merchant ships to reach the destination. Oh, I see. Huh. Dude, my army is like ridiculously strong, it seems to me. Yeah. From Hawaii to Australia, likely. I've lived in 29th of September for six months. You also live in? Do I have two of my moderators both live at the same time for like half a year? Holy fuck. Okay, this is uh, 9 upgrades from damage. He's having a very hard time defending, looks like. Yeah, my super unit has... ...lost a bit of HP. Summoning all heroes using defensive spells. Yeah, we should be able to push him. Um, I'm pretty sure it's like that. And then we need to upgrade armor more. I really want to go poison free. But I know if I can. So yeah. But you also work, or is it just vacation? Work as a bartender on Majestic Princess. You work as a bartender on Majestic Pri Princess? Yo, that's cool as fuck, yeah. Should I summon a hero on mid to support uh, my super unit? I don't know if it's gonna break his barrack to be honest. I just tried to write you a tower, but yeah, I'm not sure if it's gonna break his barrack. Okay, I need poison free. It's a very important upgrade, probably the most important one. Uh, did Richard summon a hero? Yes, he did. It's a tearful barrack on the left side. Uh, Blood of is not doing anything yet. Ah, uh, yeah, I don't defend him against my hero. By getting his billion heroes on his own, he did it. It's hard to have good internet at the ocean unless you buy the Starlink from Elon Musk. And it's still not 100% working, I believe. Our allies hero have but do you have, like, any internet at all? Can you, like, I don't know, read manga? Watch YouTube. Can you like play some video games, but like, you know, with legs or something like that? Is it an option or it's a bit hard for you? 
I'm pretty sure yeah, I should have summoned a hero. If I did it earlier, I feel like it would have been a little bit uh, bigger push, but it's fine. This upgrade is very cheap. Yeah. I'm quite thinking about it. But on the other hand, I know. The speed champion? Holy fuck, dude, he's unkillable. Do you see this guy? Thinking like a Chad. I feel like Sorok is one of the strongest races in game. Like, it's just OP. Thoughts? I feel like it's just Giga OP. Isli Naga. I have like 10 to 15 offline games from Steam Keg. Oh yeah, I guess, yeah, you can play off Steam. Off. We have tier 4 Barak. Okay, so Richard's Foundation is a Beholder. It's, it's a guy who has, yeah, it's tier 4 unit replacement, who has Charm. Every time I hear Elon, by now I get fucking angry, I got plastered by 80 plus accounts channels on YouTube. With deep fake fucking crypto scam. I'm sorry, man. I think I didn't kill his hero yet, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I didn't. I nearly blew my fucking LID lead like an hour ago. Kek. In one month, I won't be able to play most of Warcraft 3 maps I'm going to college and my laptop works so badly with Warcraft 3. Is everyone leaving me like next month? <laughs> Slug is gone. Easily is gone. Battleus is gone. After 5 5 will be strong, so at least I can read Manga and Chill. But I wish to beat the uh, first version of my map cack. He did? Damn. I might work on my map a little. I think he had a full house, right? I'm pretty sure. You map back then seem to be like very, you know, player quantity dependent, basically. Um Still for better of his, yeah, you know, it's holding damn strong. Stand over here. It's it's standing like uh, damn strong. My super unit lost already half HP just fighting this. Isn't that ridiculous? <laughs> I think it's a bit of yeah, it's it's just a little bit ridiculous. Let's get running cry uh, level four. What else is good? I like fast reflexes. Is uh, fine. I have another upgrade on dragon hide. I think it's a dragon height, yeah. Uh, tier 3 barrack by a blood elf with only two caster upgrades. This blood elf is very late. We have 39,000 of gold. 38, my bad. Richard has only 25.6. <laughs> Isn't that a little bit redonkulous? <laughs> I feel like it's, yeah. It's a bit too OP. Do you have tier 3 main? No, you don't have tier 3 main actually. I was preparing smite, but... Yeah. I guess I shouldn't. <clears throat> yeah, very hard to re-aggro with turtle. No, it's a lizard. Very hard to re-aggro the lizard when you don't have a bottom tower. Dragon skin OP, all units upgrades are usually OP, I guess. I thought so too, but it's 20% chance to block by the damage by 80. Only 20%. So every fifth hit, you can reduce it by that much. Do you really think it's good? I'm not entirely sure, to be honest. I think one upgrade on the snare is not too bad. Oh, purple left the game. Sass. Oh, Richard lost his fortress. And 
and then Richard left the game. It's good as fuck. You can think it's every fifth unit takes how damage. On on the final yeah, on the final upgrade. So I need to buy it like four times. I don't know. I think Kenny's pretty is actually now good. Innovation. I'm gonna invest into that. <laughs> Why are you finishing prediction already now? Yeah, it's not. It's not clear if I'm going to win or not yet. Is it? Why did he lose his barrack, by the way, on the middle? I didn't notice that. Not even half damage, not all units do 80 plus. Exactly, not all units. Some units can do like more damage than that. So yeah. Like for example heroes deal more damage. Uh spells, I feel like deal some spells deal more damage. So Oh yeah, I'm missing one upgrade on range. True. Yeah, still tier 2 main. Wait! But you have as much gold as me. Right? Yeah. There is a 4000 gold difference. And I attacked like ages ago. Huh? Wait, what? Yeah, like I attacked ages ago, right? I already summoned my super unit three times. This is the third time my super unit appears on the screen. Alright, I need... Yeah, just that one upgrade, I guess. You're gonna use the hit all and myself ultimate weapon. Because you didn't get ultimate weapon XD. I might actually, yeah, but I feel like I, you need like eight upgrades. On everything, right? I thought about just like hit all buildings because he went for the mana shield. Hit all, all buildings of one player. But yeah, you're right. I feel like I can hit everyone's buildings. Yeah, you need eight upgrades. Uh, it means I need plus one, plus one, and we are fine. We can do that. Hmm. I guess I'm gonna receive his attack. Yeah, I don't wanna like slow it down by pushing tier for barrack yet, so. <clears throat> tier 3 main. Finally. How many researchers do you have? 27? <laughs> Wait, but how do you have so much gold? Then. Huh? I don't quite get it, but whatever. You know, upgrades, I believe, but additional race upgrades. It says like 8, so I hope it's gonna be 8. Because every wave have like 10 units. Good name, sirs and ladies. What's up, Lotsy? Do you mind if we play the map of my choice? He went for a repair foundation. Huh. Why? Actually, no, I feel like, yeah. I guess I need all masonry. Can I just do this then? How much money does it cost? 425. Oof. That's quite a lot, yeah. I know I summoned it there. I guess it doesn't matter too much. <laughs> I guess it doesn't matter too much. Too, too much, so. The Muse of War. Uh, Castle Defense Fury. It's like a defense. Uh, 
defense game, castle defense thingy. But yeah, we can play the minions, we can play uh, whatever you want, FVG. So yeah. And then the last one, they hit your self ultimate weapon. Yeah, I know what you meant. I said like all eight, all upgrades should be eight. Is the fundal of mana? I think there is. Yeah. I know just summon all heroes. Because this guy has already rolled up, so yeah. Research complete. More gold is required. More gold <coughs> required. game's elves are insane, you need to end in game. Global ultimate weapon and self hitting ultimate weapons are two different things. Oh. Oh yeah, okay. The different things. I thought the only way you can hit everyone's buildings is that but basically we can play world of the races it's like throw chaos but a lot worse i know i don't know dude i i don't i don't like it too much world of races it is uh let me see plus you do you have the access to the shadows launch by any chance i hope you do nice he can't really lose right now, he has so much gold advantage. Yeah, I have 60 gold, 60 key gold. Purple has uh, 38. So it's uh, pretty much GG, yeah. Flash Reaper, Dragon Hide, Stone Tablet, and Snare. Spikes. Nope, you don't? Huh. Let me change that. I'm pretty sure I did give it to you. Who can join? Blade, Click, Pony, Wimp, Shadowhunters. I miss you. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. Uh, where are you? Zero Flossy. There you go. Now you should be able to. Now you should be able to. Don't give me up, eh? Ah, <laughs> uh, GGP. Yeah, I I'm pretty sure like, this game is uh, pointless, so... I lost hit throws. Yeah. I mean, dude, yeah. Whatever, I don't want. Shoot again. Did I have gold for that? I'm pretty sure I didn't. I mean mana. 